Once upon a time, we believed in the central dogma. It was DNA made RNA and RNA made protein. And the definition of a gene was that segment of DNA that contained the information for making a protein. But, but that was before we realized that there's more complexity there because DNA can make RNA and RNA can go off and do all sorts of important biological things other than making proteins. And does a unit of DNA that encodes a functional RNA molecule constitute a gene or not? And I think pretty much we say that is a gene, it's just a, not a protein coding gene, it's another kind of gene. And so it's gotten bigger and broader what that definition looks like and even the sort of the precise uh, molecular definition of where does a gene start and stop comes into question because is it just the demarcated area that has the sequence that codes the protein or what about all the circuits that are controlling that immediately upstream or far away and is that part of the gene and so these are all sort of scientific nuances that we have to work out our language but but the definition has absolutely gotten more complicated in the last decade.